Doug Ford. Buddy, what's up? How's it going, man? Um, yeah, we, we, we need to talk, Doug Ford. We, we need to talk. Um, all of you know, but a lot of the nurses are kind of pissed off with you right now. They ain't, they ain't, they ain't really, they ain't really happy with you right now, but they're not. Um, I'll tell you why, um, but I'm sure you've gotten countless and countless lots of emails and letters and so forth. Um, nurses ain't, they ain't, they ain't happy, man. They ain't happy, bro. Uh, they, they, they're not happy. Um, the, the 1% increase wages that the nurses got, that we got, um, we're not happy with that. That's about maybe 30 to 50 cents. Enough to buy you maybe a stick of gum, if you're lucky. Um, yeah, we're we're not liking that one bit. Um, the issue with this, is, let me tell you something. Let me let me tell you something, Dougie. Let me tell you something. Okay. The problem that we have is this. Okay. You know, when COVID started, we were put on this big, huge. You know, nurses are the, the you know, the 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 frontline workers and so forth and you know because of them you know we must show them respect and and all this stuff and it was it was nice it was really nice you really did a great job with you know with the whole public you know fiasco and, and the whole you know putting us as you know as important people because we are we are important people but then when it came time to asking all right bro let's you know let's let's gonna you know let's increase our compensation um First, you said we would get our pandemic pay, which, for the record, for any the public out there who's watching this, um, we still haven't gotten that money yet. Okay, that, that money has not existed yet. I know some people have gotten it, but I can say at least the majority, if not all, the hospitals have not gotten it. I work at two hospitals, and so far we have not gotten it yet. We're still waiting for it, so don't know what's happening with that. Anywho, um, yeah. So back to this whole, you know, one percent. Um, I think the major issue is if you think about it, you know firefighters and um the police officers they got two to 2.5 percent um and nurses got none now the reason why we did not get this increase is because apparently there's a bill called bill 124 i'm not going to explain it but i'll just pop it right in here for those who don't know what it is um pretty much what that bill is basically saying that it's preventing us from any increase of wages okay it's it's basically saying you know due to economic you know, status and all that jazz you know we can't increase your wage okay we, we can't um we're not happy with that we're not happy with that one percent actually um uh an insult um we deserve um we need to deserve proper compensation i mean it's kind of insulting that you think that one percent is gonna help everything and you know i kind of blame it on us nurses you know problem with us nurses is this okay we're so used to helping people. I mean, it's part of our nature. We help, we help, we help, we help, you know. You know, we're the Florence Nightingales and all that jazz. But when it comes time for us asking for help, everyone just, like, disappears. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't understand what's going on with that. I mean, even when it comes to even different, like, jobs and stuff, when there's different, um, you know, unions, for example, when other jobs are protesting and, and you know, our union supports their union, <coughs> teachers' union, <coughs> Um, yeah, we support, and then now when you know we're crying for help, no one just seems to 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 want to help us. You know, you just think like, you're on your own, kid. So um, yeah, so Dougie, you know, you, you, you kind of messed up, buddy. You, you really did. You know, it's kind of insulting that you would, you know, put us on the, you know, make us the the, the big front line on the you know the news and stuff. Oh yeah, you know the nurses, you know they're doing so great, and and, and, and you know we thank them, and we do, we, you know we do a hard work, but when we ask for you know proper compensation, you know there's some places that don't even have proper PPE, everyone just shrugs their shoulder and just walks the other way. So now, another thing that I just want to mention too is now. I know y'all are out there are going to be saying, oh, well, you nurses have a job and you should be happy that you have a job. And why are you complaining? Because there's people who had who got affected by the covid and they don't have a job and they're jobless and all and and, you know, all that mush mouth stuff. I, I, I get it. I get it. Yes, we should be happy. But here's a problem, though. OK, don't give us empty promises. OK, point blank, period. OK, Dougie, that's what you did. OK, because. You basically made these promises and said we would get the pandemic pay and all that stuff and even with compensation and then all of a sudden I'm asking for it, um, 
you know, no, no, no response, no, no, no response whatsoever. And you know what? Again, I'm just going to keep this 100. Okay. Let, let's keep it real. Okay. Nursing is a female dominated job. Okay. It is. Okay. Um, it's kind of ironic and a little bit suspect if you, if you ask me that, um, you know, the firefighters and the police officers, they got two to 2.5% and nurses only got 1%. So yeah, Dougie, that don't that, that ain't a good look, bro. That that is not a good look. I really think you should just, you know, just 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 work on that. Just really work on that. So that's all I gotta say. All right, that's all I gotta say, Dougie. Hope you're doing well. Okay, hope you're doing really really well. Um, hope you are COVID free. I hope you are um, exercising social distancing, like us nurses always say. Okay, and um, we just want equal rights we just we just want fair compensation and just to be treated properly because it seems like we do our best and 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 we like to take care of other people but for some reason people don't like to take care of us and that's not good you need to take care of your nurses you, you, you really do we, we we are the center of the healthcare system you know we 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 we, we do a lot so so compensate for your people you know what i'm saying so just just compensate so um yeah that's all i gotta say all right see ya.